What's up guys, Game Free Funeral Games here, and I'm back, and it's time to look for a match from our Monarch deck I was telling you about. Uh, let's see here. Uh, 1000 TCG, let's see if this guy accepts. Uh, I try to, you're going to see the, mo oh, he accepted. All right, let's hope, now let's hope he's not, and we don't get to go first. Oh boy, bad start already. Uh, let's hope he's not running anything too uh, too overpowered, but that's mostly common here on Dual Network. And my first hand is over a hundred dollars. All right, I th all right. I have Ryza, BLS, Effect Veiler, Maxi. And he plays Captain No Search, and he has two back row. I try to like nickname a lot of cards. I'm trying to like, you know, be like the Chris Berman of Duel and Network. So you hear like I have a lot of nicknames for most of the cards. What to do? Um creature swap. Each player chooses. I'm gonna normal summon effect veiler and see if he flinches. Sorry about caps. Okay, no response. I'm going to creature swap. Okay, no response to that because he switched. Get him to destroy his own Thunder King. If his back row is that serious, or he's just going to take 1900. And he takes 1900. And I have a Light and Grave. And we're already off to a good start. So his back row doesn't seem to be too dangerous, unless he really has a way to get his Thunder King back. Okay, he's genocidal. All right. Doesn't care. This might be a, a bubble beat deck or anti-meta heroes. He has uh, I basically have the tour guide in here, engineer here because when is there ever a bad time to special summon Leviathan or Asa Golem or Zen Mains? When what deck can I benefit for those three cards that I just named? I'm gonna get tour bus because that's what bus is used for. Effect of bus. I uh, get my veiler back. Shuffle. Uh, looking at my hand. I could summon BLS right now, but I don't want to overextend, and I don't know what that face down is. Hold on, let me read BLS real quick. It's like one monster on the face. Okay, he can't. Oh, he's not that broken. Uh, let's see. Let me attack with Tour Guide from the What the Fuck. Yeah. Or Tour Guide from Hell. So it's anything, it's a fiend, and any, everything on the world in this game is supposedly from Hell. Oh, it's e-call. Okay, so he's probably going to e-call into Stratos. Yeah, now he's going to search for Bubble Man. Yeah, it's Bubble Beat. I'll be shocked if he doesn't search for, doesn't search for Bubble Man. No, oh, so it's a, okay. So it might be just be a regular hero deck. Alright, I'm using 100. He sets one. That's two. All right. For you. That's exactly what I needed. Set that. Uh, what do I want to do now? If it was MST, he would have activated it already. So I know it's not that. Uh, I'm not going to set Max C. So I basically... 
Hmm. Do I want to have 72? But I never want to. If it turns out that he does probably have the Bubble Bee engine in his deck, I don't want to risk passing and then he attacks me for 88 for game. Because there'd be no way I could stop that. Even though I could drop Max C and pray that I draw into Dwydor into a uh, Dragodia, but that's a chance. Let's see, one Dragodia out of 32. Not really want to take that chance. Uh, psh, guy, I'm just going to... Oh, wait. I'll put Valor in my deck. Derp. So I can't even do that. So I have no choice now but to set Masty. All right. So I'm going to enter. <laughs> set Maxi in that turn. That sucked. He draws. Alias. Really, really. That was... Alright, so and I'm going to wait till he attacks. Okay, so I eat 1900. A phase two. What does he do? Ooh, he stacks. For you to hope. If I would have got the damn and now I draw engines. Okay, so what did that draw? All right, all right. So I'm probably gonna lose this duel now. Uh, didn't get a foolish burial. Didn't get frog first turn. He goes for pot. He gets warning. Transfer tribute, and he gets veiler. He's probably gonna get the veiler. I'll get. Yep. Yeah, just to play it safe. So now he has veiler in hand. So. Yeah, this doesn't look good for me. I just noticed something. If you guys ever watched all my Duel Network videos, uh, I haven't won a duel. No, I can't. I've won one duel. I've won one duel that I ever uploaded on Duel Network. But this is probably going to be another downhill loss for me. Unless I draw something good. I'll draw an enemy controller. Oh, man. Dude, this is not... This is not... This is not good. If he summons one monster, he's probably going to... No, I could change his defense mode. Now, in two turns, I'm probably going to lose. Alias. Okay. Battle phase. Oh, yeah. So I lose 19. Yeah. Technically, he could do that because he didn't attack. He didn't. Wow! What the? I lost. There's nothing I could do. I drew another freaking storm, Modoc. So, I'm going to lose. I'm going to ask if he wants to do round two. Because that was pretty bad. That was very bad. Like, what the hell? Okay, so he does accept round two. All right, so now we have a match on our hands. Uh, Nothing I really want to side. It's just... Uh... Um... No, but you can. I don't know what the big deal is why people don't like siding on Dual Network. I never get that. I just realized what I could have sided, but we're just going to see how this deck runs raw. No comment for my first hand. If he has Valor... That, should I just scoop now? Okay, so no Valor. And since there's nothing in my graveyard, I have to tour bus in the tour bus. I hate doing it, but whatever. I should thin the deck out. It on Zen mains or Leviathan. 
Hmm. Either way, if he has super poly, he's going to vacuum clean both. He could vacuum clean both Leviathan and <sighs> Absolute Zero would be worse. So, overlays and mains and defense. I could do, I'd rather deal with a, I'd rather deal with a Nova Master than a, than an Absolute Zero. It's a max change into in the acid any day of the week. I would take it you viewers out there could agree with me too. A foolish burial. This wow, my next three draws were going to be frog. Wow, Duelin Network. Oh, M. Wow, that is oh my. That's crazy. That's not even. That's not even cool. And yes, the reason I didn't set the world decrees is because I want to special summon the darn frog next turn. For those who that's probably out there wondering. But wow. Strido's probably gonna search for Neos again since this is probably not the Bubble Man engine. This is just regular standard heroes. Which I have to worry now I have to worry about top decking miracles. Yeah, he gets Ilias. Shuffles. I wish there was an option that came up where you could Cut your opponent's deck by having the option to shuffle his deck again. That would be interesting. Okay, pot. So I don't have to worry about any summoning. Honest, Valor, Torrential. He gets Torrential. He sets two, and he now he realizes that his two cards, and now he has to shuffle again. But yeah, like I said, I wish there was an option that you could cut your opponent's deck online, put a put a little bit more real, realism into this game. Uh, waiting for an end turn. Okay, so he ends his turn. Standby phase. The damn frog. Is he gonna blow up the field? No, he's not. Okay. But to grave Jinzo. If you can't warning it, it's I have him locked down. Alright, so Oh, he had to probably read Jinzo, but Jinzo's like a twelve year old card. No more than that. Uh so I'm gonna switch this to attack. Since Zen mains can fear nothing, I can fear nothing. He didn't Veiler Jinzo, which can you? I think he can Veiler Jinzo, I'm not sure. But no, no, right, he doesn't have it in his hand. I just realized that he put it in his deck. So this is starting off very, very smoothly on him in turn. So it looks like I'm gonna win now, unless he dark holds me. And then I'm like sad face. So yeah, Let's see what he could do. He could. If he super polys me, Nova Master. That's pretty much it. Dark Hole and Nova Master right now is only two ways out of this. So that's two cards out of 32. Which I don't know how many miracles he's running. I don't know how many supers he's running. And I don't know how many E calls he's running. He just dropped E call. So let's see what happens. Uh. Let's see what he's going to get. He gets alias. Hmm. Summons alias. He has miracle fusion. Oh no, honest. Oh. Okay, I lose nineteen. All right, I respect that. I respect that. Now he use traps again. All right. I haven't seen Honest in a hero deck in a while. Hmm. Um. Trigger effect, so I still get to destroy those two. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, Tarantula Tribute, he gets one on one attachment. Don't know what that face down is, so we're gonna be a bitch and we're gonna go to end phase and we're gonna pop it. Alright. So he gets he gets around Zen Mains. No. Detached. Wait, hold on, I'm thinking. So I kind of have to. I detached. And I. Oh, I do have to pop myself. You're right. So he gets around Zen Mains. So yeah, he got around Zen Mains. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Because I could have choose not to use effects, but Zen Mains would still die. So I'm going to eat this 19. Yes, draw Monarch. Serious. Uh, and turn. You know, I think I might. I'm now. I'm thinking about thinking. I'm bleh, now. I'm rambling. Now I'm thinking about taking out the two royal decrees. Cause I can't. What's the? Yeah, I have Jinzo, so there's basically no point for the royal decrees because it's stopping me from the frog, and he's gonna smack me for 44 for game. Oh, dang! I'm so free. I am free. This is bad. Like my, my record online is horrible. Die. Well, anyway, that's the end of this battle. Uh, give me like 10 likes if you want to see the deck profile of this deck. If you really want to. And you guys could probably help me tune it. But I already see one problem. I'm probably going to have to wind up taking out the world of the Decrees. But anyway, this is Game Feed for all games, guys. And I'm out here. Later. Peace.